I've been a racer, so uh, it's not too much of a worry if I come into a race fit. Good job, Corey. Thank you. How about uh, how about the fact that you kind of labored? I'm not going to say obscurity. You had a good career, and then suddenly <laughs> you really clicked. Well, you know, when when Coach Gibby came to Michigan um, after my junior year of college, we we both sat down and agreed that I haven't been doing what I should be doing um, on the track and in my uh, my outside life. So. We both agreed we were going to get this thing on track, and and we had a two-year block to do that, and it came on right at the right time. So it's just kind of a picturesque last couple of years. Yeah, a huge improvement. Just just going from <laughs> being good to yeah. It really it really just took a 100% commitment to the plan and to getting good. Uh, you know, any anything that got in the way previous to Gibby coming. No, I had learned my lesson. I, you know, everything was running related. Everything I did with my life, so it was a big commitment. So, so would you say it's maturity? You think it's uh, yeah. mental maturity? I think or? it was a big, a big time. Uh, it also a lifestyle decision. Just yeah. I wanted to be really good, and uh, that takes a certain uh, lifestyle, I believe. Compare your, uh, your your thoughts and your strategies going into this, you know, this heat versus like a heat at NCAA's. Um, you, you know, when you're one of the favorites. Well, you know, I, I kind of. Just wanted to have fun with this experience, um, not be so nervous, so uptight, enjoy what I was doing with the sport. Um, so I, I was able to sleep well the past week, you know, didn't lose sleep over it, and just felt great going into this. Excited, ready to run fast, and uh, ready to finally run with the, the professionals that I hadn't raced in a long time. So it was cool. All right, thank you. Good luck in the final.